Jesus Mate. I must have said that. I am very relaxed and refreshed. Not just because I completed my GTM and my brother completed CC. <laughs> because for a long time, I was exceeding, uh, throwing again. Otherwise, every day morning when I come out, my big man asks, Sir, what are you doing? I have a lunch. And my son asks, Sir, Dad, Dad, what time do you come back? My wife asks, where are you going? I was confused. Shall I tell you to? I'll leave this room. If I'm not, if I haven't joined in most parts, I would have messed up my life with all these questions. Either by telling the truth or making senseless story. But in real life, all of us face the very tricky questions. Someone may ask you, at the interval of a movie, Hey, have you come to the movie? You will be shown. And you are at the railway station, someone says, hey, Are you going to the place? In real life situation, you will face so many questions, but nobody trains you, coach you, teach you how to stand up and smile, listen to the question properly, and make up few tasks, and speak politely, briefly, and make sense at the end of your half an hour, half an hour. Today, today I have prepared a few topics to make your life very simple and rewarding as well. The rules are very simple. You can walk slowly like a king or king or queen. Come here, take 30 seconds to relax, breathe in and breathe out. But you should take minimum one minute, maximum of two and a half. Otherwise, you will be given one more now. The first topic goes, Old proverb says, you are dead. But I say, you are dead.
He said, I did not fail thousand times. I succeeded thousand times in finding out what all I cannot use to make a bulb. So be optimistic, dear elephant. There is always a lady elephant waiting there. Sorry <laughs> to fall for your wonderful drum. So go out there and explore the world, dear elephant. After all, I can fly around wherever I want, but the world needs me. You have occupied your seat in a flight from Bangalore to Delhi. You were surprised to see your co-passenger was round up. How do you spend your time as you travel back to Bangalore? Yes, sir. Come on. Give me a Good evening, Toastmasters. Uh, what is your name? I'll act as if I don't even know him. Rahul Gandhi gets too much attention. <laughs> Frankly, he hasn't done anything yet to deserve the amount of attention that we give him. We put him up on a pedestal. We say, oh, Rahul Gandhi, come take this garland of flowers, take this garland of money. But yet, he's yet to do something. Oh, this is going to little sorry. Um, but still, I think um, I really get once someone doesn't know that you know what they are actually doing, they tend to open up a little more and then I will find out what what he really plans on doing. You know, I will put him in, I know actually who he is, but um, I will put him in a situation where he thinks that he's having a discussion with someone who doesn't know that he's trying for a particular decision and doesn't really need my vote at that moment. So I will find out what is his actual plan and then I'll go tell everyone who, who Rahul Gandhi really is. Because when he comes up on stage, he's trying to impress you, obviously, because he wants your vote. But when he does when he knows that this person is so indifferent that he probably doesn't even vote, then he'll open up more and he'll show his true face. Okay. There is more hunger for love and appreciation in this world than for bread. Mother Teresa said very really long time. Anand? Give it to Yeah, when you are a child, 
you try to follow someone and if you succeed, you continue in that way. If you succeed, you try to take that path and you continue on that path. And if you have, as you grow younger, and if, and if you're not able to succeed, then you try to find another way. I can tell a couple of my life stories. When I was a child, growing up, growing with the limited uh, financial resources and suffering with you know, very, so many problems, problems that were self-esteem and everything, all those problems. My father used to tell me, so with this behavior, you will not go anywhere, you will not end you anywhere, you will not succeed. And I could not be done. And, and he showed me some way and I did not like, I tried and I, you know, I did not succeed and I tried to find some, some other way. Yeah, I am sure like you know, I initially you know, I did not you know, succeed. I did not give up. I tried again and again and I am able to find the other way. One of the speakers said, Sama Sulfur is in fact 10,000 times. And you know, he tried 10,000 times, finally you know, he succeeded. Similarly, if you take the NBA bas basketball, Michael Jordan failed 15,000 times. Now, he missed 15,000 shots. But you know, because of these failures, so he became you know, champion in the NBA. So life is like that. So, even you know, if you fail, so take it as you know, the stepping stone for your success, and you will succeed. Over to you. I was shouting to myself, this blade is useless, I could not shave properly. My son was 6 years old and said, no papa, that blade was very nice, I used that blade to sharpen my pencil. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to be successful in, in tabletop session, you need to feel like a child, eat like a child, eat like a child, you will be the leader. Thank you. Now, it's time for food. <laughs> Let's all uh, move upstairs for a break. We'll be back in 10 minutes at 8 10 sharp. What about this? I feel here to practice. Reading a story can practice. You find the right story. You find the right story. Yeah. I found one, but then I felt that you take the story, simple story, with a lot of active voice statements. Essentially, a Panchatantra, okay, or a Isam table. I found that there is a vitamin. 